I'm the mayor, and my door is always open for you. My name is Tom Peters, and I'm full of ideas. How are you? Knock, knock. Hello. Yes, how can I help you? Well, uh, it's official. Um, I'm a grandpop. Fine. And uh, these are for you. Oh, thank you, Tom. Well, technically step-grandpop. Uh, one of Joy's oldest daughters just gave birth. Uh, we're calling her Joy Minder Pepper Peters after her grandmama. Here's a recent picture. Oh, my God. What a beautiful baby. Well, she's what they call a wolf child. Right. Um, trouble is, I'm pretty allergic to her, you know, un unfortunately. Um, and, and you are? Um, well, it's Tom Peters. Hey, Tom. Well, it sounds like you're going to have to update your Friendship Alliance profile. Uh, friendship, friendship Alliance? Let me just log in here. Want, Want to make new friends? Create your profile. A way to meet real friends online. Friendship Alliance. Let's see here. Single, married, divorced, grandpa. There we go. Step grandpa. All right. All done. Now we just play the waiting game. Hey, Tom. I saw your profile on Friendship Alliance. What was I going to tell you? <clears throat> Gibbons. Will you add me as your friend? Cool. Check you later. Gibbons, you're already my friend, dummy. Oh, look at that. Hi, Tom. You look like a super fun guy. <laughs> cool. Let's meet up and hang out. How about Saucemans at 7? You hear that, little Joy? Your grandpa pop's got a new friend. Hi, John. Can't wait to meet you. P.S. I love Saucemans. Where do you go to get all that sauce? Saucemans! But what about the meat? Bring your own meat! What can I do with my meat? Dip it in the sauce! Dip it in the sauce! Mmm, that's great yeah. sauce. Over a thousand dip and sauce combinations available at Saucemans Family Sauce House Style Sauce House Restaurant. Meat not included. Uh, John? Tom? Guilty as charged. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Tommy, take a seat. Oh, thanks, John. Uh, I hope you don't mind. I brought some of my own meat from home. Wow. Tom Peters in the flesh. Man, just great to finally meet you. Oh, by the way, nice call with these sashes. Well, thank you, John. I just thought it would be a, a nice way to spot each other in a crowded room. <laughs> and, uh, hey, what the heck, it's not a bad icebreaker either, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I might wear mine all day. <laughs> <laughs> and if you don't mind me saying so, you look very dashing in it as well. <laughs> <laughs> like a couple of dressed-up gentlemen. <laughs> Where's me top hat, Tommy? <laughs> Oh, better get my walking stick in my in my white spats. <laughs> Here we go again. <laughs> oh, you kill me. Oh man. Look, I don't want to sound forward or anything, but I think this is going really well. I know. I, you know, I didn't want to jinx it or anything, but I, I think we're really hitting it off. You know what? I usually do this alone, but why don't you come deer hunting with me tonight? Ah, <sighs> shoot, I'd love to. Well, actually, I kind of frown on hunting, but uh... frown on it. Oh no, no, no. I mean, what I meant to say was, uh, Joy and the boys are uh, with their stepdad this weekend, so um, I'm left babysitting little Joy, <laughs> which <sighs> it's tough on me anyway. But darn it, don't worry about it, buddy. I don't know why I had a rush things. I, you know, I go hunting every night, so let's just go tomorrow night. Oh, thanks, John. That's, that's a load off my mind. <clears throat> oh, I got this, John. No, no, I got it. No, John, please. Tom, me... did you hear what I just said? No, I got it. No, John, no, I brought the meat. I'm paying for it, okay? Tom! No! 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 Okay? I just said, we're new friends, but be cool. Yeah, knock, knock. Mayor's office. Who's there, please? Just uh, Tom Peters checking in. Hey, Tom. Well, I wanted to stop by and drop off this balloon baquette. Uh, 
Just as a thank you for setting me up with the Friendship Alliance. Tom, don't worry about it. My pleasure. Um, I actually just met a really wonderful man a few days ago. Card moi. Uh, uh, Tom Peters' phone. Tom, it's me. Listen, I'm in big trouble. Who's this, John? Yeah. Who do you think it is? Mayor, you're not going to believe it. It's my new friend John calling. Ah, speak of my devil. <laughs> uh, what is it, John? Well, I was out deer hunting, and I saw this small creature on top of this deer. Yep, yep, girl. And I was like, what the hell is going on? This isn't right. So I took aim at that little critter and just blew him away. I think I've been bit by a bumblebee. Well, I get up real close to the thing, and Tom, I think it's a small man. Sort of like child size, but it had a beard. A really horrible smelling beard. Oh, no, Gibbons. Uh, what's that about Gibbons? No, it's not. <laughs> you don't say, John. That's so funny. <laughs> what? What are you talking about? It's not funny. What? Oh, you silly goose. Come on. Meet me at my house later, okay? Uh, <laughs> you're so great. Bye now. Tom! What was that all about? No, no, no nothing. Uh, John was just telling me a funny story. <laughs> great. I love stories. Oh, man, I am so screwed. All right, just just relax, okay? Uh, let me fix you a warm glass of Diet Iced Tea. I just got a new box of powder, so. Okay, now where's that creature you shot? I buried him. What? He's, he's dead? Think so? I don't know. Maybe. Probably not, though, man. I'm freaking out again. Now, hold on, buddy. We can figure this out, you know? That's what friends are for. Now, just tell me, did this man have a big, bushy beard that kind of smelled like horse manure or a dead animal? Yeah. Yeah, like a garbage can before you rinse it out. How did you know? Uh, it's my friend Gibbons. He loves to ride deer at night. <sighs> I'm going to miss my old friend. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm sorry, man. I'm... <laughs> oh, hey, guys. Hmm. Mind if I pop in? <laughs> oh. John, this stop bird. it. <laughs> Come on, John, put the lamp down. My head. John, that's my friend you're hitting. You stop. John, please stop. Yeah. Uh, dumb yeah. John. Yeah. Oh, my God. What did I do? I did it again! Oh, Tom, I'm so sorry! All right, calm down. We can fix this. We just need to get him to a hospital. Tom, we can't! They will know I shot a man and buried him alive. They'll throw me away for life. But he's bleeding, John! Tom! We're best friends! It's game time! Now grab the duct tape out of my bag. Let's go. Do you have any rat nap? And this ought to keep the little bugger quiet for a while. Here, open your mouth. Come on, come on. He's just bitter for a second. John, John, I, I really don't think any of this is necessary. We have to do this. We need time to figure this out. It's the only way. Oh, my God, it's the mayor. He's going to know. Tom, don't say a word. I'm warning you. No, John, now this has gone too far. I'm going to tell him, okay? The mayor is my friend, and, and so is Gibbons, for that matter. Can't let you do that, friend. I told you no! Why does anybody listen to me? Not in front of my step-granddaughter, please. She shouldn't see this. Um, hello. Uh, who's there, please? What do you want? Um, where's the man who lives here? Oh, he's walking the baby. Oh, I love that little baby. Have you seen my friend Gibbons? Uh, he missed jumping class this morning. I'm a little concerned. Nope. No, no. Listen, uh, you better go away. I haven't seen him. Okay, um, but if you do hear from my Gibbs, please let me know. Oh, okay. Okay, I gotta go take a crap so I won't be near the door. I won't be able to hear you anymore. So you should probably leave. <laughs> what the heck is... Oh my god, that's Gibbon's beard. Oh. Uh, what is going on here? I taste rat nap on my lips. <sighs> and I can't feel my legs. Listen, Gibbons, I don't want to sound like a monkey's uncle here, but maybe if you weren't riding around on the top of a deer last night, we wouldn't be in this pickle jar. <laughs> Little Joy, shut your hairy mouth, okay? Freak! Gibbons, are you in there? I, I smell you, Gibbons. You two keep it down in here. What? Excuse me, sir. Uh, I think I smell my friend's beard in here. No, I, I was just using the bathroom. No, no, I can recognize that stench anywhere. Well, he's not here. Sir, please let me in. Well, I can't, no, because I'm house-sitting, and they told me not, don't let anyone in the house. Give it! Oh, Gibbs, let me take a look at you. Gibbons. Oh, man. You look just like a little snapper turtle. <laughs> Oh, I miss that beard so much. Oh, my 
lights out. Oh. Ah. 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 Come and listen to me. Ah. Ah. Had to come in the door. Had to come in. Had to know. Was I gonna? Oh yeah, Gibbons has to pee pee. Should I just go here, or do you have a place where you put it? Hmm. Just go ahead and pee in your pants, boobs. That's what I've been doing. I'm I'm sorry, guys. This is all my fault. You know, meeting my new pal in Friendship Alliance made me forget about my old friends. Right. Listen, man. I'm so sorry things turned out this way. <sighs> it's okay, John. I understand. You know, some sometimes friendship can be real hard work. <laughs> God, this is awful. What did I do? What, what am I supposed to do now? I can't control my temper. Well, I know what I would do if I were in your boots. What? Well, I'd give us a concentrated dose of retina. What that's going to do is knock us out for a couple weeks, and then I would pack a bag and get the heck out of town. All right? When Joy gets back in a couple weeks, she can wake us up with some reviver rat. I love you, Gibbons. Now get out of here. But what about your step-granddaughter? Who's going to care for her? You really want to be a friend? You know it. Take her, John. Take her. Absolutely.